So here's a quick recap of the different ways you can mark a task as done as studio once you're done working on something or preparing something. Uh, this does not mean you've handed it in. It just means you're, you're done working on it. Um, anywhere you see a task in studio and you see its icon, like let's say this homework icon right here, if you tap on it once, you get the task info, little window there. And on the bottom right, you see a circle. Uh, this circle can be used to mark it as done. So if I just tap in there, it checks it. Uh, I can uncheck it at any time if I made a mistake. So that's the, the, the basic way. Uh, there's a shortcut for this. You can double tap on the icon itself. If I tap tap, it marks it as done. And again, tap tap, unchecks it if I made a mistake marking it. So basically, that's it. Uh, we encourage users to uh, mark things as done as uh, they go, just to make sure that you, you cover what you need to do. Uh, and for example, in the tasks view, when you have lots of these things, uh, it's a good idea to, you know, once you're, once you're done, say, studying for this uh, algebra exam at the top, it can mark it as done as well from here. And notice that in the timeline, if a task is not yet due, so it's due in the future, but you're done working on it, it will stay there until that date goes by and is done. So it'll, it'll go away from the list once, uh, once the date goes by. Uh, there's also ways to mark things as done in groups. So in the planned area on the right, there's an edit button on the top of it. You just tap edit and you can select multiple tasks and mark them all as done at once. So that's a, a quick way to uh, mark a whole series of them all together. If you have many that, uh, let's say, are late and you just did a whole bunch, you can just mark them all in one shot to save some time. There you go. So that's how you mark things as done. Uh, we encourage you to uh, clean up your to-do list by marking things as you go.